Vitamin K2 is a crucial nutrient that helps prevent health issues. It removes calcium from arteries and soft tissues, directing it into bones and teeth, where it strengthens them. A deficiency can lead to calcification in soft tissues, osteoporosis, and cavities. Vitamin K2 can be obtained from foods or converted from vitamin K1, found in leafy greens, by specific gut microbes. Foods rich in vitamin K2 include natto fermented soybeans, goose liver, chicken liver, beef liver, eel, butter, cheese from grass-fed animals, salami, pork chops, and fermented vegetables like sauerkraut. Many people are deficient in vitamin K2 because these foods are not commonly consumed. Ironically, foods high in vitamin K2 are often fatty foods, which have been discouraged despite their benefits. Vitamin K2 is fat-soluble, requiring bile for absorption, making it difficult for individuals with liver issues or no gallbladder. Factors like antibiotics, steroids, antacids, GMO foods, alcohol, junk food, sugar, blood thinners, liver disease, and low-fat diets can harm the gut's ability to produce vitamin K2. Magnesium is essential for vitamin K2 to work effectively, but it's often deficient and hard to diagnose. For calcium-related problems like kidney stones or artery calcification, a magnesium and vitamin K2 combination can be effective. Vitamin K2 has two forms, MK4, synthetic, and MK7, natural. MK7 is recommended with a dosage of 100 micrograms per 10,000 IU of vitamin D3. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more insightful videos.